Melissa, uh, Melissa Cabral is joined by a very special guest, Find Out More. I love going into candle shops, this is a little confession, <laughs> and smelling the pumpkin candles because they smell so good. Yes, they do. Oh. I just want to eat them. Yes, exactly. <laughs> so you've come up, uh, Libier, you've come up with some great options that are DIY. I didn't realize how easy it is to do stuff for yourself. Right. At home, doing your own facials. I mean, I love that. My mom used to do that to herself when I was a kid, and she would put like avocado on her hair. <laughs> I'd be sitting there thinking what is what going on but there was truth to yes, it it totally works absolutely so today you're showing us how to make a pumpkin peel yes right? this is for your face and this is when you feel dry and yes. dull and you want to brighten your skin pumpkin is filled with fruit enzymes so we're going to take a half a cup of pumpkin okay. and then we're going to take one teaspoon of olive oil and this is just like hand pumpkin canned pumpkin okay. yeah you can use organic if you you know if Prefer. you want to be more okay. yes um, and then i use one tablespoon of raw honey okay and then we can put one teaspoon or tablespoon of um, unflavored almond milk. Okay. And then you go ahead and just mix it, give it a nice little mix. This is going to brighten and smooth your skin because it's just so, so, so filled with fruit enzymes and alpha hydroxy acid. So do you do it in the morning, in the night? How you often do you do it? You can do it at any time, as long as you put it on and you leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes on your face. And then you just wash it off. And then you just wash it off. And you'll see just such a huge difference in your skin. Especially Beautiful. right now, because you're starting right to get now. that dullness and the dryness yes. with the weather changing. Yes. Okay, so that's not all. What is this right. one here? This one is a scrub, and I put half a cup of sugar in here. We put a little bit of olive oil, and of course, we put some pumpkin spice oh, in there. Oh, this, okay. yes, that's where I'm smelling. <laughs> you oh, can eat it, right? Yes. What I love to do with this is I take it in the shower before I shave or do anything like that, and I just <gasps> exfoliate my can, whole skin. Yes. Now, what kind of sugar right. do you recommend using? Um, you can is use there... whatever sugar. I use white, but you can use brown, and you could even put some coffee grounds in there if you want a little oh, more. That does. Action. I've done. I've done it with the uh, low budget. Uh, <laughs> Mobile boutique, we've done it. It yeah. works to help, especially with the eyes. So, would you use this over your whole body? Yes, it is. I mean, it's completely edible. You could even eat it. But <laughs> yes, you can use it on your whole body. You can even actually use this before you do the peel because it would exfoliate your skin oh, really, really nicely. help to create yes. the luminosity. All yes, right, yes, last yes. but not least, last but Epsom not least. salt. Huh? Yes, Epsom. I love taking a nice hot bath. I mean, it, let's talk about a little self care here, uh, right? I, I don't yeah. have time for that. <laughs> but, but this see, is how you become you, a girl yes, boss, right? Yes, yes, yes. I think it's important to take time for ourselves and to just give back to our bodies and relax and unwind and the way that I love to do that is do Epsom salts and put them in a hot bath now the way you create a concoction for the perfect fall one is to do two drops of cinnamon two drops of clove and two drops of uh, Orange essential oh, oils. Essential oils yes. is the key to get and it. And that okay. will smell like a pumpkin pie in your bath. <laughs> oh yes. And then it just it really does yeah. help to yes. just release all the stress and everything. Yes. Now you if you're watching and you didn't grab your pen and paper, shame on you. No, it's okay. <laughs> we have it all on your website, right? Yes. LiviaReynolds.com. And then you also on Snapchat, people can watch you do a DIY every yes. week. I do Monday through Friday little uh, snap productions. <laughs> and I like to do DIY stuff because I don't know. I like to do things that you have in your pantry. Right, you know? which makes it so easy and yes. it's so cost effective yes. because some of this stuff can get a little pricey. Absolutely. Well, I love that you're here because you're sticking yes. around. Yes. All ladies will appreciate this next segment <laughs> in the 8 o'clock hour. If you were tight on time, you hit the snooze too many times, maybe you had to wash your hair and dry it. Yes. Three instant outfits yes. that you can have ready to go. You're going to show us how to do it. Very, very nice. Yeah. Okay, make sure you stay tuned for that. Coming back over to you. Okay, thank you very much. Go ahead, a little comment.